Yo, King Games the first here, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Sword. I've transferred some Pokemon in the range of levels 1 through 10 from Pokemon Home to give myself a useful starting team. And since Home gives you a free level 5 Pikachu, you know we had to add them to the team. Like this video and subscribe to the channel. Let's start the video. Fletchlings I wasn't paying any attention to, but they're level 32, so I won't be using them anytime soon, but just gave myself a couple, um, these are ones I know I've bred with good IVs, so I'm only going to bring an Abra to start with that I know has good IVs. Everything else, I'm going to have that Pikachu from home, uh, then a level 1 Charmander, a Gibble, a Mimikyu, and an Abra, uh, along with our starter. So, do have some other options here. some interesting stuff <laughs> but all of this is you know these are options I can switch into later all right I may I may do that for some of them <laughs> yeah when I uh, get my team average to around level 10 I'll probably swatch switch in one of these two most likely the Bulbasaur all right let's just go ahead and make sure everyone is healthy That is a dope animation. So cool. Right. What do you sell? Huh? That's a good amount of money. Typically don't use items this early huh? though. What do you gotta say? Yep, they heal for free. I knew that. Pokemon questions. Ah, the first town. Oh, hey, Indeedy. Very interesting. Really? Who needs a move? Aber needs a move. What do you want? Oh. Okay, hold on. Surely, surely someone here gets a move. Ooh, it's physical though. Can give Pikachu nasty plot from the get-go. No way. Hold up. Wait a minute. Lame. Oh, I'm going to abuse the hell out of this. Why shouldn't I? It's here. It doesn't cost anything? Okay. That's insane. That, all right, I'm gonna have to try that out. Let's just talk to people here. You're looking for the Pokemon professor. You can usually find her at her lovely home by the lake, enjoying the slow life. In the morning, my Pokemon wakes me up and in the evening, I put my Pokemon to bed. I can't imagine a life without Pokemon. <clears throat> Fair enough. Berries. I've got your fresh picked berries. What do you say? Interested in something? Uh, I mean, that's cool. I don't think I'm going to need any of that right now. How about you? I heard that Leon has a younger brother. I bet he's an amazing trainer just like Leon. Uh... It's fun to do some shopping in a boutique. Even just getting a new hat can change your whole look. Oh, is this a clothing store? Welcome to our boutique. Anything I can help you find? 
All right. Well, Mom, thanks for that pocket money, I guess. Here's where it's going. All right, guys. They didn't have black pants. They have no black pants. Not here. But I got to get that stupid feather thing off my knee, whatever it is. So this is the look for now. Yes, a lot of purple. I know. Having a meal with your Pokemon makes the food taste extra good. Oh, oh. Pokedoll. A doll that attracts the attention of a Pokemon. It guarantees escape from any battle with wild Pokemon. I knew that. Hoppa's up there. Is there anything else this way? You know what? I should I should get a few levels on these level ones. I've just remembered what the sign here used to say. To the right is the Pokemon lab. To the opposite side is the station. Oh, can I still just walk up in people? Yep. And just walk right into random people's houses. That rather grand building beside us is the Pokemon research lab. But if it's Professor Magnolia you're seeking, you're fi you'll find her at home. Down the far end of Route 2. Oh, this is it. No, the floor of the room. Gotta say hi to the Pokemon. Alright, well, let's grind a few levels here. Yes, it has static! Nice! Alright, that's your one shot, right? Right? With a, with a single nasty plot at this level? No, but that's a lot of damage. Oh, the physical defense matters not. Fool of sheep. I shall strike you down with thunder. for uh, an encounter at this level, I know. Oh, but look at that, yes! Oh, damn! Nice! Which one? Oh, Charmander? Uh, I, I mean, I can get rid of Growl. I mean, just like that, it's like all my Pokemon are usable. All right, I mean, do we do one more just to see? Oh, okay. So the AI hasn't gotten any better. feel the need to like grind all day if it's like if it's that simple let me go ahead and heal up at the pokemon center real quick and then we just in advance we can advance the story now now that i've spent most of my money on clothing just to not look vanilla you know moment I can get black pants it's happening yo hop listen King Games I've been thinking if you're a Pokemon trainer now you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge right gym challenge the gym challenge mate the annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion 
But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to snuff. So I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she can help. You've got to take part too. A proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger, after all. Keeps you motivated, right? The professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams the chance to train up a bit along the way. Okay. I'm down. Whose house is this? Sonia and Leon used to have a healthy rivalry, but... Oh, okay. Leon loves Pokemon and loves Pokemon battles. I remember he would always go all out, even on practice matches. Oh, battle's a battle, bro. Oh, oh. Can I even get in there, though? everywhere. What are you telling the kids? In order to bring out the full strength of their Pokemon, trainers must be knowledgeable. I would agree with that. Oh man, rotating the camera would be so nice. Missed opportunity. You see that house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where the Pokemon professor lives. Doesn't seem that far. Very scenic. Oh. Over here, King Games. All right, King Games. It's time we filled in our teams a bit. And I'm here to teach you how. All right, you came out of nowhere. You'll need to catch Pokemon if you've got any hope of filling in that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? Only, look at you, little King Games. You've already caught some on your own. I mean, two. Your mom gave you those Pokeballs, did she? Oh, did she? Is that where I got them? I'll give you some more Pokeballs. In return, I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. Almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? You obtain 20, 20 Pokeballs. Oh, what's the most you normally get? Like five, maybe 10? 20 Pokeballs, bro. All right, I'll catch everything I don't have. Oh, sorry, sorry. You, your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, all right? All right, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. You think so? Not as shocked as she'll see what I got, but you know, I'm like. I'm basically cheating, but without that feature, Pokemon would... Oh, ooh, ooh. I want a Yamper. Yes, special. Alright, so... Ooh, it's a level 7. Okay, maybe I should go back and grind a little more then. Um, Let's see if Gibble can do anything. At least it'll be immune to the electric attacks, right? That's not good. Tackle's gonna hurt now. How sad would it be if I felt the need to, like, really stride it? I mean, I don't like losing Pokemon, bro. Alright, I gotta do... I gotta do one more. You shouldn't kill it, right? Alright. And that's... Yep, doesn't affect me. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. Ouch, this is gonna hurt. Alright, yep, two tail whips. What? 
The Emperor found a Pokeball. I don't... Okay. What does that mean? Does that mean... Means when I catch it, it'll be holding the Pokeball I used on it the first time? Double team for Pikachu? Uh, did you have another useless one? Growl. Um, I'd say they're about equal. Sure, I like, I like double team thematically. Aesthetically more. You gonna move yet, Abra? Nope. How, okay, what level did my punk, oh. Data, of course. Ooh, I'll take that. I'll take that. Alright, um. So, first off, I'm gonna go back and heal, because, you know, that's an abusable mechanic, but. Oh, I guess I didn't. Oh, I saw a sparkle. But. Right, leave me alone, the Emperor. Is this a trainer? Or was it it's on site, ain't it? What you got? It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. Yes it is. Alright. You don't know you don't know what you're dealing with. You're challenged by young youngster Jake? I'm gonna smoke you. You're not prepared for a metagamer like me. I bring Pokemon from generations ago. Right. You with the static. So you move. Oh, no. Alright, you got lucky. You got lucky. Now he you with me. Oh, okay. Well, you're dead anyway. Good job, Pikachu. Our men are going real fast there. Yep. Give me your money now. That's how that works. Oh, did the Squovit run away? Give me whatever this is. Two potions. All right. Trainer tips. Pokemon can gain XP points by battling other Pokemon. XP points help them grow stronger. And your Pokemon will still get XP points even if you catch a Pokemon you are battling against. Put that feature in. Another yamper, right? Oh, leave me alone. Do I have to go? I have to go this way to get whatever that item. Oh. I don't want to battle you. Three more Pokeballs. How many have I used? Four. The items over there. No, but let's battle this trainer. Cute and strong, together in combination. Okay. Fairy type. Challenged by Lass Lauren. Supposed to be Chew Tool. Uh, um, Dreadnought is what that evolves into. Which is like partially dragon type. I don't know what it is now, but that means. That means we use a Pokemon that doesn't actually have any fucking fairy moves. But hey, Mimikyu will learn something eventually. Oh. Oh, is this the... No way. This is the totem Mimikyu. Oh, shit. Okay, so does that mean it's water? It's water. Water dragon? The dreadnought is... No, no move yet. Is this 
was I thought the sprite looked a little big, but it was just like, you know, it's just a sprite, but look at the size of that fucking Mimikyu, man. Yeah. How f really? That is, okay, the Emperor are like, aggressive. I couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat you. No, you're not. Youngster Benjamin. Lip bug. That's a bug. So that means either flying or wait, is it? Is it? I can't. Okay, because from that angle, Pikachu looked big as fuck too. All right. Well, we know bugs are weak to fire, so let's just use fire. Oh, that's kind of bad. Wait. This move can't... Okay. Interesting. Nick it. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Should probably turn that off so we have to battle like, like real, for real battles. Um, we can go Dragon Pulse. So what, Dark type, right? Oh, quick attack. Not, not gonna do much, right? Should I be using Ember for stab? Critical hit, nice. Okay. Give me that money. Lose to wild Pokemon, lose to many trainers. If I had a rod. Oh. oh, I do have a rod. Oh. I didn't even read the thing. Alright, fishing is the same as it always was. Alright, wild magic park. I mean... I'm gonna transfer one over almost certainly, right? I don't have to catch this. Use it for XP. Alright. Alright, free XP share. Alright, so I'm liking the game so far. Many things seem to be just pure upgrade. Look, there's the professor. So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness no, the whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... What? Hey, I got, th I got that card. Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my guests. My name is Magnolia, welcome young trainers. Now, come, let's head indoors. Why, Hop Deer, I see Wooloo has made some new friends. And you must be King Games. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonia? I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, King Games? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. And it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. 
there are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know. Like how many different types of tea there are. Oh, um, I'll pass. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee here he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Op and King Games only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Deary, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Galar region, be Galar region become strong trainers. Isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. The goal is precisely the reason uh, I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Oh, there's that look in your eye, Hop. Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Right, I'll be waiting outside, King Games. Okay, I, I thought we were about to battle in her house. Like, does that still happen in these games? You have to say, now remember, be sure to give it everything you've got. That's the best thing you can do for your Pokemon, and for yourself, too. Anything cool? Oh, hey. Do what, do what plants would want instead of what you want. If you keep that in mind, plants will grow. Okay. I mean, it makes sense. It's upstairs. Oh, books. This is a girl's room. Okay. All right, let's go battle hop. Where you at? Hurry it up, King Games. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. I'm gonna become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. Of course. He healed us up, so we're ready to go. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen, you two. The reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. Yeah, no chance, Hop. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Pokemon Trainer Hop sent out Voodoo. I knocked you out once before. You were level three last time. What level are you now? Have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to the test and see. Okay, you've doubled in level. But I have nasty plot on the Pikachu. Right. Static, 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 damn it. Now, let's do one more for good measure, and I should be able to sweep the Pikachu, right? Alright. This doesn't one shot. I don't know Pokemon. Alright. Score bunny, nope. Right? Unless you're faster, which you shouldn't be. Right? This is broken. Uh, it'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. Is this your last Pokemon? It's not really a close one at all. Oh yeah, it's your last Pokemon. Alright, well. Bad luck for you. 
EXP share is amazing. Well, look at you. Seems you've really learned your type matchups. <laughs> Bruh, I've been playing since Yellow. Pikachu was my first Pokemon. Oof, gutted that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. I know what gutted means, so I'm, I'm guessing this is like supposed to be the UK or somewhere, somewhere there. And I even got my Pokeball throw perfect too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? King Games, ha, huh? well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. Really? Alright. Okay, I'll take that letter of endorsement. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm gonna win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still, and plenty rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charizard, Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Hop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out, things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I'd been worried about you still obsessing over that not sort of nonsense. But it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, King Games. Alright, King Games. You and me are going to train up against one another to aim for that champion's title. Absolutely. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? King Games, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. How convenient. Wishing star. With one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive, yes! Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know? I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever! There, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hop. <laughs> those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now, and I'll have you sorted. Alright, you've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please, give King Games and me the power to Dynamax our Pokémon. First we got to battle against that mad Pokémon in the Slumbering Wield, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. I'll take the free heal. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Up, is it true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you can't tell me about it? Can't tell me about it. Er, well, there was this weird heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. King Games tried to fight it off, but then I think we both, pa both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A right fount of information you are. King Games, hop, these are for you.
got a Dynamax band from Professor Magnolia. All right, so we can Dynamax now. At a power spot. Okay. Not all the time. Those are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night into those bands. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as all that. There are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now don't be afraid to go all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help fill out your Pokedex too. The Legend of My Reign is finally about to begin. Come on King Games, I'll beat you to the station. All right, I'd say that's a good spot to call it. Guys, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. I'll catch you next time.